Hey, what's up, everybody? The Rye Man here, coming to you with another, the, 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 another Splinter Cell Blacklist video, and that was me being an idiot. Hooray! I splashed some water on my face, so I feel good. And I have a soda, so I might be a little bit on the hyperactive side, but that will not deter me. Come on, man, you gotta talk to me. Negative on that, Briggs. Do you have any idea how many bridges you burn with that Gitmo stunt? It was necessary. Are you arguing with the results? It's not about the results, and you know it. You pulled agency favors and made the agency look bad. You took the star witness out of play, even if he was chicken feet. Langley doesn't like that. What are you saying? I'm saying don't call anymore. You might want to think about making that transfer permanent. Damn. Intercept a fuel tanker that is suspected to be a target of the American fuel blacklist attack. I'm interested to see how this is all going to fare, considering the fact that we're bugged. And I think Sam knows that we're bugged. Thanks. Let me know if Ollie needs anything. Is that BD Apart from some cosmetic damage, it looks like the plane is fine. It's good to hear. Charlie. What? Any update on that hijacked ship we're after? I'm still working on it. They named the attack American fuel. A loaded tanker would make one hell of a weapon. What the hell just happened? Don't look at me. Graham? The SMI isn't responding. I'm locked out. Charlie? Oh, this is trying to work around. Briggs, you got anything? Nothing. All I got is lighting and internal comms. This is the flight deck. We're losing engine power. How long can we glide? We're talking minutes. Navigation systems are down. We have only manual flight controls. We're gonna check the rear panel. I can't get us up and running that fast. I don't even know how they got control of the plane. Oh, shit. Talk to me, buddy, damn it. Flight deck, what's going on? This is the co-pilot. We need a medic. What's wrong? The captain cracked his head when the plane dropped. It's bad. He's unconscious. Repeat, the pilot is down. Is the plane under control? Shit. All the engines are dead. Trying to restart. I'm locked out of the navigation controls. Can you fly? Yes. I mean, no. I can try to keep it together manually, keep her in a glide, but I need another pilot. It takes two people to properly work the controls. Oh, boy. Don't tell me I have to fly this thing, because... My god, we're all going to die. Oh no. Briggs, check on the pilot. Where are you going? To get Coven. Elevation 28,000 feet. And I'm the only one who can unfuck us, right? Pilot's unconscious. Shit! What happened to the co-pilot? He's flying manually. I get it, it's a two-man job. Dump the power, kill the backup generator, reboot the system. Okay, I gotta get to the flight deck. Yeah, let me out of here, Fisher. Fisher, let me out of here. Take care of the power. Hey, dump some cargo while you're down there. It'll buy us some time. Briggs, head to the back of the plane. We need to lose cargo fast. Oh boy. On my way. I'm this is crazy. In case we don't make it. Sam, I've got the cargo bay door open. All right, let's move. This is crazy. Why did he we take the time to? Lose to... Dump the chopper. All right, push, push. My God, put some muscle in it, boy. Guys, we're about to hit some rough air. You better be ready. Not an option. Shit. Briggs, get me light on that. I'll shoot it free. Where am I shooting? You think you can hit it from up there? I guess we'll find out. 
get line of fire. I don't know what I'm shooting at. I am moving as fast as I freaking can. Drop down the crane. You should be able to get your eyes on it. You in position? I've got the shot. Hang on. The other one. There we go. Okay, Fisher. Here's the deal. You gotta cut the power so we can reboot the system. You gotta do it now. The reboot console is under the subfloor, below the SMI. I gotta cut the power to the Paladin. Coben, you are a fucking awesome Access dude. Capture, the electrical bay is there. Whoosh, whoosh. Coben, generator's offline. Alright, good, now hang on. Get your ass to the cockpit. I need your help with startup. On my way. Sam, hurry. I am trying. Sam, we're losing altitude fast. Do not pressure me, woman. I am moving as fast as I can. Given the fact we're dropping vertically to the ground to our inevitable deaths. Ah! Move, Sam, move! What the hell is taking you so long? Oh, I'm sorry, you try to move like this. A complete vertical drop. What's the problem? He wants to reinstall the whole system mid-flight. Yeah, I'd be done by now if this jackass would get out of my way. He'll crash the plane. What the fuck do you think is about to happen? Let him at it. It's active. All right. Okay, for sure. You gotta pump fuel back into the engines, all right? If I get this thing back online, we're gonna have seconds to fire it up. The manual fuel pump controls are in there. All right, once I reboot, you gotta pull back hard, okay? We're gonna get one shot at this. Damn, nosedive. Two. One. Coben, you saved the day, you beautiful bastard. I, I think we can afford having him out of the cell now, I'm just saying. The dude's the only reason we're still alive. I don't know why, I just like Coben as a character. Maybe it's that cynical attitude. Oh man, that was intense. Screw you, engineers. I think they just deterred us, though, from going to American Fuel. Which means an attack got through. What's our status? The main systems are back online. She's flying, but we're flying blind. Grim, internal comms work, but the other communication systems are still offline. Hey guys, what the hell just happened? We were hit with a Stuxnet-style virus. I rebooted the SMI from backup, did a full system scrub, but clean. How did the engineers get a virus on my plane? We'll do the forensics and get you some answers. Oh shit. What now? It's a communique we received right before the plane went dark. The White House activated continuity of government. What does that mean? It means all the top military and government brass were sent to protected bunkers to make sure they survive. Last time that happened was 9-11. Oh my god. Do you think that last blacklist attack... I don't know that yet, Charlie. Just focus on restoring communications. LNG terminal. Ooh. 
Hey, Grim. Any update on how we were hit with the virus? I'm buried with repairs. I gave Charlie point on that. You find anything? Nothing. That's not like him. He'd take a stab at a guess before he'd ever admit to not knowing something. Yeah, he seems off to me, too. Thanks, Grim. I'll talk to you later. Dude, it was only 10 minutes, but that was intense. Hey, Sam. Hey, Briggs. Any problems? Yeah. Suddenly, I don't think about throwing Colbin out the cargo bay door all the time. It's weird. First time for everything. Yeah. I guess even an asshole could be a hero sometimes. Yeah. 84.6. I think if this isn't the last mission, what we're going to, then the mission after that has That's to be the last me. one. We'll talk later, Sam. Yeah, suddenly I don't feel like throwing him out the cargo hold. I never did, honestly. I, I've liked him since the beginning. It's so weird. Call me a, call me a hardcore Coben fan. Despite all the shit he's done. I need to play Conviction again to remind myself. Coben. Hey. I was wondering when you'd thank me for saving your ass. You saved your own ass. We just happen to be on the same plane. After everything I've done for you, you still treat me like this. Ease up, Grandma. I'll still come visit. We're done here. Jesus, you're a downer. Would it kill you to let me be happy for like one minute? I think that's Sam's way of being like, okay, you got a little bit of respect, but you're not going to get all of it because you're still a dick. You know, I can understand that thought process. Hey, Sam. How we doing, Charlie? Good. Yeah. I mean, fine, considering I had to roll the system back to before the virus. So you know the exact time we got hit? No. I mean, maybe. It's, it's just hard to tell, you know? I'll follow up with Grim. That's all for now. Right. Yeah, I should get back to work anyway. Yeah, it seems off. How did they get a virus on our plane? I mean, that would have to imply that there's somebody within our group that's effing us up, right? Maybe it's Charlie? Maybe it's Coben? I don't... Th Maybe it's even Briggs. I'm pretty sure it's not Grim. After everything we've been through, I severely doubt it's Grim. Alright. So this thing looks like modified Stuxnet. Modified. Modified. Uh, adaptable to new hardware configurations. Uh, just on the fly. Sends new specifications back home. And then gets reconfigured remotely to match the new system it's in on. This is just beautiful work. I mean, you know, it sucks, but it's beautiful. One of your people did this? Hell no. I was thinking it was one of your buddies. Yeah. Well, this is very elegant. Very dangerous. Can shut down any system it gets into. <laughs> Learn that the hard way. If I were you, I would get across the Atlantic. Contain the fires at the liquid natural gas terminal and stop any engineers on site. I actually want to look. Yeah, we basically hit American fuel. Then we have American blood and American dust. I want you to keep cycling the frequencies and don't stop until you get through, okay? Briggs, any word on that hijacked ship? Outside communications are almost entirely blacked out. I can't sync up with anyone yet, but the crew's working on it. Charlie. The virus. I found the source. It was executed when we gutted the tablets and picked up a mirror wall. That's impossible. This system I is... I streamlined a couple of security protocols. I was just trying to boost operating speed. You let it infect the system? That's how they found us in Mexico. No, it wasn't. When we were on the ground, I contacted a former associate with the cartel. The engineers have a bounty out on us. He must have rolled on me for a cut. Charlie, why are you talking? The American fuel attack was successful. That must be why they activated continuity of government. What was the engineer's target? Sorry, Sam. Still getting flooded with intel. Got it. Looks like Louisiana, Sabine Pass, a natural gas tanker. Oh my god, Sabine Pass. That's the biggest fuel facility on the Gulf Coast. The engineers hit the facility with a computer virus right before the tanker hit. Security systems, fail-safes, 
Everything was disabled. The virus operates exactly like the one they hit our plane with. Oh, shit. Every fuel facility on the coast has been infected. If that fire spreads... They'll all go up one by one. We have to contain the fires. That explains it. The refinery is not the place to go subtle. The SMI's optimal loadout is all about scouting with a tri-rotor and inflicting heavy damage with frags. I'm fine with the equipment I have, dude. Let's go. Approaching jump run, Sam. Ready? Pilot is dropping to half an angel. Reducing speed. And three, two, one. Go, 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 go. Grim, Sam's away. Copy. Here we go. The LNG terminal. We are so close to the end, I can taste it. Oh my god. This is one potent ass virus. My god. Disables any system it gets into. Just like shuts everything down. Grim, I'm on the ground, headed towards a down chopper. The seals look like they're taking heavy ground fire. Engineers? Affirmative. They're pinned down. Not sure how long they'll hold out. So we gotta save them? Sign. You're not gonna pull the trigger. Stop pointing that thing at me. I'm here to help. Who said we needed help? Where did you come from? Off the books. They tasked you to secure the facility. They sent us to stop the fuel tanker, but they sent us too late. We got here after the crash, then tailed the squad of foot mobiles. We almost got their leader, then everything went to shit. Grim, I got a high value engineer target on the ground. Give me a location. Find engineer leader. No breaks in the line. Keep moving towards the main facility, Sam. Dude, there's so many of them. Time isn't on your side. You have to push through. Ah, damn it. Needed that information yesterday. Ah, here we go. Alright, guys. 
this is all the time I have for this episode. Um, yeah, quite an eventful, that little, little mission here. Saved our plane. That's the most important part. So, hope you guys have enjoyed this. I am the Ryman. If you guys have, I encourage you to leave a like and comment as it helps and benefits the growth of the channel and tells me you guys are enjoying this. I am signing out. Have a good day, everybody. Happy gaming.